Thanks to Surfshark VPN for sponsoring this video. More on them later. Joyce Randolph is arguably one of the most iconic American TV actresses. Born October 21, 1924 in Detroit, her journey in the limelight began in the golden era of television and continued for decades. Randolph's career took flight when she landed a role on the iconic series The Honeymooners, which aired from 1955 to 56. She played Trixie Norton, the wife of Ed Norton, one of the show's beloved characters. But she also remains the only main cast member from The Honeymooners who is still with us. How did she get her start and how did she become such a successful actress? Facts First presents The Honeymooners Last Surviving Cast Member Turns 99. See her today. Jackie Gleason Jackie Gleason was a larger-than-life figure in the world of entertainment, known for his remarkable career in comedy and television, with a special focus on his iconic work in The Honeymooners. Born February 26, 1916, in Brooklyn, New York, Gleason's journey to stardom was marked by his distinctive talent and relentless commitment to making people laugh. Gleason's breakout moment came when he transitioned to radio and later television. His variety show, The Jackie Gleason Show, became immensely popular in the 1950s, but it was the creation of the Honeymooners that etched his name in television history. Premiering as a series of sketches on his variety show, the sitcom depicted the lives of Ralph Cramden, a bus driver played by Gleason, and his wife Alice, portrayed by Audrey Meadows. The working-class couple's humorous trials and tribulations in their small New York City apartment resonated with audiences and became a beloved part of American television. What set the show apart was its authenticity and relatability. Gleason's portrayal of Ralph Cramden was a masterclass in physical comedy and emotional depth. He perfectly captured the frustrations and aspirations of the common man, making Ralph a timeless character. His chemistry with Audrey Meadows was electric, and their witty exchanges, punctuated by Gleason's signature catchphrase, one of these days Alice pow right in the kisser, became legendary, despite not exactly working in today's environment. The Honeymooners had a relative short run from 1955 to 56, but its impact endured for decades. Audrey Meadows Audrey Meadows, celebrated for her portrayal of Alice Cramden, was a talented actress whose career has had a lasting impact on television. In 1952, she was cast as Alice in the comedy sketches on The Jackie Gleason Show, which later evolved into The Honeymooners. The role became her defining moment, securing her a permanent place in the hearts of television viewers. Audrey's portrayal of Alice was a revelation. She brought depth and authenticity to the character, portraying a quick-witted, patient, and loving wife to Jackie Gleason. Gleason's Ralph Cramden. Her character served as a counterbalance to Ralph's brash and often impulsive nature. The chemistry between Meadows and Gleason was palpable, and their on-screen partnership became the heart and soul of the Honeymooners. Audrey's Alice was a strong and relatable character, frequently delivering clever and memorable one-liners that endeared her to audiences. One of the show's enduring qualities was its depiction of a working-class couple striving for a better life. Audrey Meadows' performance as Alice resonated with viewers as she embodied the aspirations of many Americans at the time. Her role in The Honeymooners was a prime example of how a well-written, well-acted character could become an iconic figure in TV history. It earned her widespread acclaim and admiration. She received multiple Emmy Award nominations for her portrayal of Alice, and her contribution to the show's success was undeniable. Beyond her work in The Honeymooners, Audrey continued to enjoy a successful career in television and film. She appeared in various TV shows and movies, but her legacy as Alice Cramden stands as a testament to her talent and the enduring power of the sitcom. Art Carney Art Carney, a versatile actor best known for his role as Ed Norton, had a remarkable life and career. Carney's early life was marked by a passion for performing. After serving in World War II, he delved into the world of radio and soon transitioned to television. His break came when he joined The Jackie Gleason Show in 1952, where he played Ed, the endearingly quirky friend and neighbor to Gleason's Ralph Cramden. Art's portrayal of Ed was a revelation. He brought a unique and eccentric charm to the character, making him a person perfect foil to Ralph Cramden. The dynamic between Carney and Jackie Gleason was exceptional, and their comedic partnership became the heart and soul of the Honeymooners. Carney's Norton was lovable, well-meaning, and somewhat dim-witted, known for his oddball ideas and his memorable facial expressions. His ability to deliver humor with his impeccable timing and physical comedy endeared him to audiences. Since the Honeymooners was celebrated for its portrayal of working-class life, it's no surprise that Carney's Ed Norton was a key element of its 
appeal. His character's quirks and friendship with Ralph Cramden resonated with viewers, as they represented the everyday struggles and camaraderie of the era. Carney's work in The Honeymooners showcased his comedic brilliance and his remarkable ability to connect with audiences on a personal level. And his contributions to the success of the show didn't go unnoticed. He received multiple Emmy Awards for his portrayal of Ed Norton, cementing his status as one of the finest actors in television comedy. Despite the relatively short original run for the show, its impact has been long-lasting. And Art's portrayal of Ed continues to be celebrated as a beloved part of American television history. This video is sponsored by Surfshark VPN. Surfshark VPN is an online privacy tool that keeps your online identity safe from big companies, cyber criminals, and anyone else who might be after your personal information. Our favorite thing about Surfshark is the VPN, or Virtual Private Network, capabilities. Surfshark VPN changes your IP address to give you a new virtual location, which can be practically anywhere in the world. In addition to protecting your location data, this allows you to access content libraries and streaming services from other countries. For example, you can find classic films such as The Shawshank Redemption, Goodwill Hunting, and Goodfellas when you log into Netflix with a Canadian IP address. If you use Surfshark VPN to log in with a UK IP address, you can find hit series like Star Trek Discovery and the US remake of The Office. Beyond unblocking all of this content, Surfshark VPN encrypts all of your online data to keep you safe when browsing the web. If you act now, you can get an exclusive Surfshark Black Friday deal. Enter promo code FAXVERSE to get up to six additional months for free at surfshark.deals/faxverse. Surfshark offers a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk to try it out. Just use the link in the description below to get started. Joyce Randolph Joyce Randolph, celebrated for her role as Trixie Norton, has had a remarkable life and career. Born October 21, 1924 in Detroit, she's now 99 and stands as a living legend, her work in The Honeymooners remaining a cherished part of TV history. Joyce's early career was marked by determination and a passion for the performing arts. Before her breakthrough role in The Honeymooners, she had appeared in various theater productions, which helped her hone her acting skills. But it was in 1951 that she was cast as Trixie Norton, the wife of Art Carney's Ed Norton, in The Jackie Gleason Show. And, of course, these sketches eventually became The Honeymooners. Her portrayal of Trixie was a delight for viewers. She brought a genuine, down-to-earth quality to her character, playing the role of the sensible and supportive wife to Ed Norton. Her chemistry with Art was unmistakable, and their interactions on screen added depth and humor to the show. Her character, like those of her co-stars, reflected the everyday struggles and dynamics of working-class life in the 50s. Beyond her work on The Honeymooners, Joyce Randolph continued to have a successful career in the world of entertainment, including appearances in various TV shows and films. Her versatility as an actress was evident in her ability to tackle different roles, showcasing her range and talent. At 99 years old, Joyce Randolph has become a living testament to the enduring legacy of The Honeymooners. Her work as Trixie Norton, alongside her fellow cast members, continues to bring joy and laughter to audiences of all generations. Her remarkable longevity and significant contribution to the golden age of television made her a revered figure in the world of entertainment. Joyce's portrayal of Trixie remains a cherished part of television history. Now it's time to hear from you. Are you a fan of Joyce Randolph? Did you know she'd reached her 99th birthday? Let us know in the comments section below. Thanks again to Surfshark VPN for sponsoring this video. Click the link in the description to learn more.